I'm Chris with iPhone in Canada. Today I've got a quick tutorial on how to unlock your iPhone running firmware 5.1 or firmware 5.01. Now you must have a jailbroken device. It has to be jailbroken. Now as you can see right here, I have my iPhone 4S and I just showed you my Bell SIM card. I'm going to put that into the phone right now. My phone is locked to Rogers. So when I put the Bell SIM in there, I get no service. As you can see there, it did some searching and once again showing me that I have no service. So what I'm going to do here is again prove it a little bit more. I'm going to tap on the phone. I'm going to dial 611, hit call, and we're going to see that the call failed. One more time, I'm going to hit the call back button, and once again the call has failed. So as you can see, the Bell SIM does not work. So to prove it even more, I'm going to pop out the Bell SIM. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my Rogers SIM that I do use for my iPhone 4S. I'm going to plug that right back into the phone here like this. All right, push it in there. Now we're going to see that it's going to be searching. It's going to be looking for the Rogers signal. This will take a couple of seconds. And here we go, and there you go. You can see that now it is running on the Rogers network, and we're going to try the 611 again. Welcome to Rogers. Pour le service en français, appuyez sur le vide. So as you can see there, it did work. So what do you have to do? Well, you need to go into Cydia first of all. As I said, this is only for jailbroken devices. So once you are into Cydia, you're, want, you're gonna want to go into Manage. Now what you're gonna wanna do is go into the Sources and you're gonna wanna go up to the top right there and hit Edit. You're going to then hit Add and you're going to add this repo. All you have to do is type in repo, R-E-P-O dot Bing, er b i n g e r and then the dot com once you have that you add the source now this is going to verify the url now it's going to update your sources it's going to provide all the packages from that url now this should just take a couple of seconds you can see it's adding all sorts of packages now it's reloading your data And now we can click and hit return to Cydia. So now what you want to do is you want to hit that repo that you just added and you're going to want to add SAM right there at the bottom there, SAM. So when you click on that, it'll give you the option to install it. I've already installed it, so you want to install that. Now when you're ready to go, you want to make sure you have the SIM card that works in your phone. So once you make sure you have your SIM card in your phone, you go find your SAM preferences there. You're going to want to tap on utilities and you're going to want to deactivate your phone. Once it is deactivated there, you want to pop out the SIM that does work on your phone and you're going to want to replace it with the one that you want to unlock it for. So again, I've taken out my Rogers SIM card right now. I've grabbed the Bell SIM. I showed you that it didn't work before. Now we're going to put it into the slot there. Once again, you can see there's the Bell SIM card going into the phone. So now that you have your SIM card in there, you're going to want to hit tap the SAM button there, and you're going to want to hit the enable. Now you go down to method, you want to make sure that it is on auto detect, go back once again, now go into the utilities again, and hit attempt activation. Now you should see this screen pop up. Now, if you do get an error, don't be alarmed. Just keep hitting the attempt activation button. Doesn't matter how many times you get that error, just keep hitting the attempt activation. This time for me, it took several tries. Sometimes it takes one try, sometimes it takes many tries, but just keep hitting that no matter what you get there for the error. So once it has worked, your phone will reboot. As you can see there, it is going black. It's going to be respringing this. We should get the screen popping up right away, and there we go. We'll slide to unlock. You can already see that it says bell there over at the top, right there. Now we're going to try this again, just to make sure it works on the bell network.
So there you go. You see that it is working on the Bell network. So it's very, very simple to do. Now, say you want to go back to your original SIM card. You just have to go through the steps again. Make sure your Bell card is in there and then go through the SAM preferences to unlock your phone again. Put back your original SIM card and it should be working just fine. So there you go. A quick tutorial how to unlock your phone. Again, make sure it is jailbroken. That is a must. And this will work for the firmwares 5.1. 5.0.1 as well. For more daily iPhone and iPad news, make sure you check out iPhone in Canada and iPadincanada.ca and make sure you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of my future videos. I'm Chris with iPhone in Canada. Thanks for watching.